Hey, this is Russell, back again with another episode of Software Inc. Let's get today going. We'll try to get through more days than we have in the last couple episodes. Uh, we have had a lot to do, but, you know, we've uh, done it now. We should be able to cycle it. We are going to have very good control over our customer service stuff now. In fact, we can probably go ahead and assign this to 200,000. Just because we have uh, two marketing teams now. So we'll see if uh, we can keep up that. Uh, keep the hype up. All that jazz. So yeah. Things are looking good. We have, uh, you know, all our teams working away, doing what they need to do. And we got to make sure to watch for 1995. We also have to make sure to watch these things when we get done with iteration four for these dudes. Uh, we'll be releasing them. Well, not releasing them, but changing them to the next phase. Um, yeah, look at this. Got 594 bugs done. And probably prioritize this one a bit more. <laughs> Even let's set it to four. This is going to be a really well polished product. In fact, let's set this all the way to 10 for our team. Because I don't really want them doing much with this now. This is already overkill for a first product. Um, speaking of that, I want to see still. What is it? All software or upcoming software is actually what I'm looking for I'll find it in a second oh yeah I was gonna like find out where that button was uh, we need to put speed coders in offices times two view oh okay uh, duplicate not a big deal. Well, bam. That's that. Uh, what else was I going to do? <sighs> Upcoming releases. So, yeah. Um, the plan is to just sit on this money, man. Sit on this money. Um, let's go ahead and transfer another... Where is it? Investments, another 10k in the bonds. Uh, let's do 13 million actually. Look at all that interest we're getting. Every bit counts. My releases, we still have 200k in stock, so I'll buy some more next time. We're going to be able to, for quite a while, uh, just go ahead and bank our uh, money for a while. What do we got? It's interesting how this shows. Okay. Never really used the event calendar much. Go ahead and cycle this here. All software. That's all I've ever done though. I could have sworn there was an upcoming releases button. Could have sworn. Where is it? Am I that blind? That's education. I don't want to do that right now. It must be blind. Anyways, I'll find that one day. That's probably what I wanted to find in between episodes. I completely forgot what I was going to be doing between episodes besides doing the benefits for uh, those guys. 
And I, I did do the benefits for the night shift, by the way. They have that. Uh, so yeah, see they are coming in their green cars for the night shift. Um, yeah, it's pretty cool. We'll sit on this for a while. Make our money money. And making money we are. 158. Let's uh, go ahead and order. Let's do another 500k. Let's drop a million. Well, bam. Because I have no doubt we're going to keep selling for a while. I don't remember where upcoming movie releases is, but I remember the next 2D editor isn't coming for a while. So. Oh, man. Where is that upcoming releases? It's not under all software. Can't be. Trade. Yeah, no, those are... Uh... Let's do release. Yeah, no. So, 1993. Are we the last? We aren't even the last 2D editor, I think. No, yeah, 2D editors came out after us. September, November, they came out afterwards. But none of them have been able to take us out of the market. That's the biggest thing. Huh. Weird. I'm confused. I'm confused a lot in stuff. Stuff and things. But I should be able to fix that eventually. <laughs> uh, so yeah, check it out. Everything's looking good. We're just gonna sit on our growth for a while. I don't wanna keep spending more over 200K, but we're kind of, you know, not exactly maximizing the amount of our workers we have by not having more things being marketed. I suppose, uh, when is it the next uh, release for this? One biggest thing, the benefit of having two shifts is we're able to keep the followers from dying on this, I guess. We don't have many followers in the first place, but it's something. And I'm going to need to know when the upcoming releases are too for these things. I really am going to have to find that button in between episodes. I don't want to spend the whole thing doing. So yeah. Um, I don't plan on doing any research teams yet until I probably have released a couple more products on the audio of 3D paint. Because um, at that point I'm going to have to start finding ways to be more competitive on these three products. Eventually I'll do a research team, but it's a bit early for that still. Also, I'm a little bit newer to the research teams. I have messed around with it a little, but that's about it. Um, so I don't like to implement something when I don't have a ton of money banked up. <laughs> I want to wait till I have very huge money bags until uh, I really start doing research. I'm comfortable starting to do research teams. Question is where I would put it. Um, I might make like the warehouse right here for like printing like copies products and, and eventually uh, hardware and stuff like that. And then next to it, I might make like a research building. That might be the way to do it. We'll see. We'll see what we have space for and if we even stay in this complex where we go ahead and build a new building. We might even have to move somewhere. Because, uh, I mean, you know, it's not like we have a ton of land over here. I mean, we keep expanding into those spots, too. It's just kind of meh. Kind of meh. <laughs> um, I wouldn't be against expanding here, actually. Like, building our, like, research building on this side. Have the road go all the way through. That could be nice. Hmm. That's a way to go, too. That would mean we'd have even more room for a warehouse. Hmm. 
interesting ideas. One person called in sick. So I think we have, if I just go ahead and do this all the way to here, we have a total of 63 employees right now, which is pretty big considering the fact we started with one only like, what would it have been? Was it start 1980 or 1970? I think the start is 1980. So, uh, yeah. 1980. In 14 years' time, we have that much employees. Pretty good achievement. I mean, I'm sure, uh, you know, there's a lot of players that do much better than this, but for me. <laughs> for me. Can't forget who's playing this game. It's Russell. Um, so that is still a ways off. Um, I'm not comfortable releasing this yet. How's the support for this? We have 376,000 users still active on this. And we've missed zero so far, which is the biggest thing. We want to have that nice and up there for that market recognition. Um... Yeah, we can change the price once it's released for the 3D Ether. Um, how is this? Does this even have active users? I guess it has 40 active users. Um, I mean, they've all been fixed. We're even gonna get anyone. Let's watch today. If we get even one person queued, we're, we're actively losing these users. 33 users, one queued. I'll let this run one more day and then I'll cancel support for it. No need to clean that there, clean that off. Um. Well, bam. Hey, everyone comes into work all at once. And yeah, those uh, users are fixed. These guys are almost done. It's only like 10. Having two teams is a little bit overkill at the moment, but we're really going to need these two teams when uh, we release like all of these things at once. In fact, we're already going to be kind of hard-pressed once we release uh, Zebulon Office. Really. Um. Let's go ahead and uh, deal with canceling this, I guess. This is almost ready to develop to the next phase. And everything's looking good. Pretty happy with this building, in terms of efficiency at least. And none of the buildings I make are the most efficient, but it's not the most inefficient thing you've ever seen, right? There's got to be some uh, YouTube series out there that's being even more efficient than me. <laughs> got to be. We've got some cues. We got some marketing. And yeah. Not much to do at this point while we wait for these things. Go ahead and look around town. Really dusty when you zoom out. I like the dust effect. This whole plot is like really clear, which is interesting. It'd be kind of cool. I've never really built things like at the opposite end of the town. They'd be, be kind of cool one day to just, you know, throw over at the opposite end of the town, the warehouse or something like that. Make it like a separate place. I'm considering moving into a skyscraper, actually, like moving into the city. 
Um, I mean, I, I do prefer the town over the rural and the city. I think this is like the nicest one, but I feel like I want to do something big for uh, for this series, like move into a skyscraper. I think that could be pretty cool. So, almost ready to develop it. So moving into the city might be fun. Eventually. I mean, the biggest thing with the city is the traffic, you know? <laughs> it's true about living cities in real life, too. Oh, wow. Where I went right here, it's like really dark. As if it's like a, a smoke cloud. Oh, what's going on? No, I do not want that to make changes to my computer. I'm a f I guess I accidentally clicked the program. <laughs> yeah, well. Sixteen minutes in. It's a bit of a slower episode because I kind of done everything now. <laughs> the last couple episodes was me doing everything, setting everything up, and now we're just waiting for the next release date, which is quite far off, you know. Uh, the queue's getting kind of big again, really. I mean, these guys are even struggling to keep up with it now. Wow. You know what we'll do is we'll set this to. Hey, so the Dingleberry that I am. I uh, <laughs> stopped recording by accident uh, when I was typing in the number for uh, reducing the marketing. I accidentally, uh, well, I uh, stopped recording. So <laughs> you haven't missed much. I, I changed the marketing budget to 150000 I ordered like 150000 more copies, um, and we made a ton more money just sitting here. Um, but yeah, that's about it. I'm not sure if I you saw me already develop this too, but this got to 100%. So I was able to develop that to the next level. Um, pretty soon I'm getting to the point where I'm going to re release this press release and the press build um, for this thing right here. I don't know why I clicked that. Um, actually, it looks like, okay, this is where we can select the server. Okay. So actually, we're going to be able to select the server here now, right? Yes, we can do SEM now. Okay, perfect. So we'll just have to remember to do that for these two as well. I knew there was a button or a way to do that. So yeah, I'm just kind of waiting till this episode's over so that I can find out where the upcoming releases button is. I need to make sure I release this during the right time, um, you know? But yeah. That's the idea. Um, we'll let the episode go on for like maybe like seven more minutes. Um, I think that's a good time to stop this off. Uh, look at that. We got some... Uh, wants us to do marketing. I don't want to do marketing until I know when the release date is. And I can't find where upcoming releases is to save my life. It's been so long since I played this. I played in like 11.7.40 last time I played this. And uh, since then, a lot of things have happened in life that makes me <laughs> kind of blank out on all this. I played a lot of other games in between this session and last session. Man, it's driving me nuts I can't find the upcoming releases button. Did they change it or something? They better not have. That could be really be screwing with me. They probably haven't changed it. Uh... I might go back and watch one of my previous videos to remember where the upcoming releases button is. How crazy as that crazy as that sounds? <sighs> Snap! Oh, what, is, what am I doing with my life? Uh, well, we've steadily been growing in market recognition. Steadily been growing in uh, money, 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 uh, money, 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 money. Before the day is up, let's just throw. What bam? 20k and look at that so we're getting some real if you look, look at our company value except on close yep 
company value, where are you? 31 million, check that out. Did we lose money last time? Oh snap. Have we lost our momentum? I think we've lost our momentum. Might have been a bit premature for me to put a ton of money in there. Let's see if, uh, is there something wrong? Did we sell to everyone? We couldn't have. How many uh, people have we sold to? Where is it? Net unit sold 1.6 million. Uh, details. Consumer reached 1.7 million. Is it that? Can we port it? Not really. We kind of sold to, was that 1.7 million more though? Or is it like 1.7 million total? I think we might have sold to everyone now at this point. If that's the case, then next month we should probably tone the marketing down to something really low. Uh, so we're gonna kind of rely on this release next. Um, might have uh, sent them into the bonds a bit prematurely. Oh well, let's see what happens. Yeah, snap. Okay. Uh, no need to panic. Just have to go in and withdraw the money I just threw in. Let's say withdraw 10 million for now. In lost interest. Okay, that's probably fine. We need the money though. <laughs> That's sad. It's so sad it's raining. That's how sad it is. We sold to everybody. Boo hoo hoo. What a terrible life I have. Selling to so many people. Making tons of money. Boo hoo hoo. The rough life of having lots of money. In a big company. <laughs> Such a rough life. Um, boom. What am I doing? I don't need to do so much for marketing anymore. Let's do it to 25k. To get nice and small to marketing. You passed a fire inspection. And these guys are, uh, chilling over there. Eating away. They all kind of go swarm at once. I bet I want to watch this place where they swarm and eat all at once too. They won't be able to eat all at once. They have to come in like turns, I think. Because the canteen's only so big. These guys are lounging around in here. There's the maintenance and IT people I hire. I hired like a couple extra, but I don't think I even needed to. I think they're just fine, uh, you know, the amount I had earlier. I know, we'll see. Uh, I'm losing money again. Should be able to sit on losing money for a while. Boom. That's the game. That is the game. So I think we have like one more day till I have to end the recording, which is cool. Um, let's see them all go to the canteen. Whoa, wham, wham, wham. Let's see how much you can cook before lunchtime. Woo, not much. Do I need to uh, do more food? Is Chef gone already? Oh, snap, not everyone gets their food. I guess it doesn't matter because people are still going to be able to go to the vending machines when the, the chef hasn't cooked enough food yet. That's why I don't promise free food in the benefits. <laughs> I 
Yeah, well. We can only afford so much benefits, too. I mean, obviously we're losing money again, so can't go too overboard on the benefits. As long as no one dies, we'll be fine. If everyone dies on the whole team, we'll lose a lot of money. <laughs> and that's it for this episode. That's our uh, little timer. So that's the end of my recording session, too. So that's the... Th I'm going to probably walk away and then before my next recording session I'm going to go out of my way to make sure I know where the upcoming releases button is before the next episode so I can uh, properly set the time for this to release. Uh, this is almost done 99% code so next time we'll probably not only be able to promote it but also uh, set the time for release and because I will know how to check upcoming releases next episode that can uh I can do that before uh, <laughs> before I set the release date. So thank you guys so much for watching. Like, comment, and favorite. Subscribe if you guys want to see more. Thank you guys for watching. Have a good one. God bless. <laughs>